Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play XCOM Terror from the Deep. We are under the water, as makes sense with this game, and we're also in a corner. We're investigating a crash site. It's a small, but even small ones can keep you on your toes sometimes, such as they often can when it's dark, like it is right now. So we're going to start by having some of our good friends, such as Snapperus 2, so far not dying yet, embarrassingly, which is always convenient. Tossing out some chemical flares. We have seem to have detected the alien craft. I consider this to be a good thing. Yes, that's the remnants of the craft there. Oh, good work, Snapperus 2. We shall remain there. You can continue to hurl chemical flares at a moment's notice. The Dream Knight S. On guard. As well as our good friend Bean. Bean's very reliable. It's good to have Bean on board. There has been a shot fired at our precious little tank, severely hindering its health, but so far no problem. It's a Gilman sight. That's pretty benign. Well, Jolly, sort him out. Jolly now could perform three molecular control attacks in one turn. It's a Gilman soldier! And it is such a minuscule thing, this uh, base, this uh, submarine. Well, it's good to find the soldier, because now we can shoot the soldier. It's good work, Sea Lion can think, Aquajet Tank. You did manage to suffer a minor morale hit doing that, but everyone else was happy. Silence dog creatures outside. Thank you. Let's continue our reign of terror against the aliens. His headphones just started working properly. Bean does a good throw, and so will Snapperus too. Don't give me that out of range nonsense. Don't give me that out of range nonsense. It's not out of range. That's good work, Snapperus too. Well, we need to have someone make a personal investigation, and everyone seems to have decided to become ensigns. Alright, Caterpillar, out you come. Cool. Let's start reserving those time units I mentioned. Alright, Dream Knight S. Good work. How about you, Bean? Good work also. Let's end our turn. An additional shot is fired at our Sea Lankath Aquajet tank. It, however, is unscathed, and thanks to its high levels of armor, it can just continue to press on, searching for any potential threats. There has been a shot fired, however. This caused me gre great reason to pause. We'll prime that grenade and throw it into this area here, this small encampment. It's a good throw. It is a good throw, actually. Good work, Dream Knight S. I actually said it right this time. I think what's throwing me is I have a card, like a Yu-Gi-Oh! fake card I made. It's got Priestess in it. I keep thinking of that. Maybe. I don't know. Why do I keep saying things wrong, people? Why do I keep saying things wrong? <laughs> By the way, we are winning. Somewhat. We're not really winning, but we're trying to win. And making it look good. Failure with style. That's what these videos are all about. That didn't work. Yeah, that alien reminded me how much it didn't work. It was a good try, shooting that cover. Mind you, this alien's just demonstrating why we don't use sonic blasters. Or well, we try not to use them because they just don't work properly. They do no damage. And pathetic weapons such as these tanks just go, oh, hello, die. Okay. Gilman Soldier. There was someone up over here. Can you show us the way, Gilman Soldier? Probably not. Okay. You can, however, get shot in the face of a torpedo. Or the tank can do the thing it did last time and just embarrass itself. Good work, tank. Good work. Dream Knight S. 
I want you to stand there and crouch. It's good work. There is someone else up there. But we will find them. And of course we'll kill the alien we have molecular control. It must be quite unpleasant to be molecular control. I mean, I haven't experienced it, but your own atoms just saying, you know, let's do this, but your brain's still active, you know. Going, oh, what am I doing? I'm shooting my friends. Well, that's not very good, isn't it? Oh, dear. Oh, well. You know, that sort of... Maybe something slightly more traumatic, but yes. <laughs> yep, there was the shot. Oh, there it goes. Well, it's efficient. It's one way to lose your XCOM operatives. We've finally lost an operative. It took us, like, eight videos. Oh, there goes that pesky night -ess. No longer will she dump grenades on things and they don't work. There was someone over there. And there was, of course, this alien over here. But get to it, Aquajet tank. Stand on guard. Cool. Now, B. You spotted the alien. Well, kill it. And it's a direct hit. Brilliant shot there, Mr. Oh, Mrs. Bean. Keep going, Caterpillar. Keep embarrassing yourself there. It's not going to do anything. Oh no, you did minor damage. Let's let's give you credit. Shoot the wall, please. Good work there. Shooting walls works rather well, I've noticed. Now I'm fully aware that there's another alien hiding beside that door, I think. Don't give me love games, just throw it. Thank you. Okay, can you see anything? Nope. How about you, Bean? Someone's playing around at that door, I can tell. And our tanks just shrugged off hit after hit, it's brilliant. Turn seven. We keep lurking around with Caterpillar and his friends. Turn 8. The plot thickens. We found our little man of doom. Doom. March head. Let's see how good you are at this molecular control business. Horrible at it. Good to know. Jolly, show us how it's done. In plan control successful. It's a gill man soldier. Doesn't know what he's doing. Now, first things first, um, duck around the top corner. Alright. No, just, just duck around the corner, properly. Do it properly. Cool. See, now, Bean can crouch and shoot the alien properly. Nope, nope, no, she can't. Um, yes. That's a problem. Fortunately, we can, um, throw your gun away. It's good throw. Caterpillar. Where's Caterpillar? Caterpillar's over there. Could you stand on this piece of raised elevation and shoot the silly gill man? No line of fire. Stop crouching. Shoot the gill man. Still no line of fire. Stop playing around. Now you can't shoot it all. Yay! <laughs> um, well, it's controlled. I just face it that way. Well, Ben, you get another shot. There we go. There we go. We did lose somebody doing it, but we have completed another mission. A score of 91. Isn't that exciting? I know. 91. But it's an interception, and high an interception is, is a good thing. <laughs> And we've lost an operative. That's good news for our subscribers, because it means we can add more people. And 
purchase one additional Iconaut. Isn't that nice? I know it's nice. You know it's nice. Okay, so equip the submarine. When it comes back. With one additional operative. And then we'll call it a, a video. Dark Flagrants 2, hello. So when we come back, more Let's Play XCOM. Terror from the Deep.